What's up, folks? Hey, we're back on the water. Me and my buddy Marcus, and we're going to go catch some fish. I've got a special guest here today. Not only is it, I mean, Marcus, you're a special guest here. Thanks, man. He, he's a special guest, too, but we got Mark, the owner of uh, Cornfield Crappie Gear, out here on the water. So we're going to show him a little bit about the lake, show him what, the way we do fishing. So vertical jigging on piles, big fish. We're going to have a great episode, have a lot of fun. What do you think, Marcus? I'm ready. Let's put some slabs in the boat. That's the plan. Should be a good day. We got a beautiful bluebird day, middle of the day. So it'll be interesting how that affects the bite, but three pound fishing. Fish are going in the boat. So here we go. All right, folks, you're in for an exciting episode. We got Mark Riddle from Cornfield Crappie Gear. Man, I love this guy. He's just totally awesome. Supports three pound fishing and I support his products. I think they're just the best in the industry, period. But I'll tell you what. Everybody was talking about a tough bite on Lake of Egypt and three pound fishing came in the worst time of the day and we put on a clinic. We, taught, we caught so many fish, folks. It was unbelievable. Me and Mark had a ball. But most importantly, we enjoy talking to Mark and uh, just, you know, talking about fishing. I mean, fishing in, in Southern Illinois. It's a different species than Kentucky Lake. And uh, what can I say about Mark? I just, I like this dude. Good dude. Uh, means well, and uh, it's got some great products. So check them out at Cornfield Crappie Gear. Let's put some fish in the boat. We're about to have a lot of fun today. Gotta keep dropping on top of them. Here, you guys stay here. I'm gonna go look at this stump. Anyway. All right, so we're off to a decent start. This is supposed to be a really tough day, so um, we're taking it serious. We want to show what we can do with live scope. That's important to us. We're gonna let Mark have that that spot there while we go off and explore some other spots. But we're gonna get back to Mark. He's gonna share a new product with you here shortly in the uh, episode and show some other products that we have on our boat. So it's just a great episode. So Enjoy. Bluebird Day, about 80 degrees and uh, vertical jig in. Got Mark out here with Portfield Crappie Gear. Check out their products, awesome stuff. We have Marcus out here. He's just doing his thing. Ready to catch some fish. Are you on? Yeah, you're on. Guide trips are going incredible. I just ask Marcus. He said they are. <laughs> but 
you can book for July and August. It's going to be hot. We'll start early. 3poundfishing at gmail.com. Check it out. Yeah. So there's Mark from uh, Cornfield Crappie Gear. Hey, everybody. There's the man. Got to get out on the water today. So testing a few things. So right away, I, this is the first time I've seen his boat in a while. I didn't, he just, you, did you just get the Garmin for us? I've had it for a while. We just got time to get it put on. And uh, we had a little trouble getting it to fit on here. We put a, build a wedge and put a wedge underneath of it to, to bring it up a little bit. It was kind of tilted way up underneath the boat. And then with all the wires and everything, you probably can't see it too good, but right down here, we built a, what we're calling a wire puck here at the end of my rod. And you can drill like an inch and a quarter hole in the dash panel or wherever and bring your wires through that. And this is a C-shaped piece that the wires come out and then it's got a lid that goes on it. That way we brought all the wires for both of these units out of one place. It worked pretty good. We're gonna start building those quite a bit. That's pretty nice. That's really nice. That's a good setup. I'm trying to get just, you know, when you go set, set, setting one up, you see stuff that, you know, didn't right. work or needs to be changed. So we come up with a few more things. So, so, have you spider rigged today at all? No, we didn't spider rig. I just had everything on here and didn't want to take it off this morning. We've been trying a vertical jig and found several piles with lots of good fish on them, but we've only caught a few. So, but of course, the man rolls up and smokes a big one <laughs> right in front of us. So, you know. What's nice about Cornfield Crappie Gear is the rod racks is how they stay out of the way. So, he was able to bring his spider rigging equipment, yet they're still out of the way. It's a really yep. nice setup. Yeah. The launch pads, the rocket launchers. Um, you can check out those too. Nice setup. So, but I'm fond of the uh, telescope mount myself. Yeah, that's a good one, folks. That's that's, that's, that's the ticket. Yeah, we, we're selling a lot of those with the bridge and everything. That's a good setup. Everybody likes that one. Let's go fish. Little bitty hair jig is hammering it right now. Bam! That's another fish sandwich for the party. Thank you, three pound. <laughs> Everybody be going hungry without you. <laughs> the very first time we went fishing, what did you do? Do you remember? You spilled your coffee at the bottom of my boat. Do you remember that? No. You don't remember that? <laughs> Oh my gosh, that must dude. Have been that must no, have been dude. <laughs> you, you spilt your coffee in the middle of my boat. <laughs> it was a practically a brand new boat. <laughs> I was like, who is this jackass? <laughs> there it goes. That's the Marcus I know. Look at that, folks. Later in the episode, Matt's going to show you guys how to clean crappie. No, he's not. <laughs> There you are, you're coming in that slot. That's a good fish. Ooh. I'm putting on a clinic, folks. Book your guide trips now and you can watch three pound catch some fish. <laughs> That's funny. Good fish here. Nice. 13. So this was a great day. We had Mark out there from Cornfield Crappie Gear. 
We're catching fish on what was supposed to be a really tough day, and we're in the middle of the day, bluebird day. Uh, should be tough fishing, but I'll tell you what, me and Marcus, um, we're comfortable with live scope, and at the end of the day, we're putting fish in the boat, and that holds true for any guide trip you book with three pound fishing. We're gonna catch fish. That's just the way it's gonna be, uh, regardless of the time of the day, and today we just, we put on a clinic, we loved it. At the end of the day, we ended up with 40, I believe, and just had a ball hanging out, chilling with Mark, and uh, check out his products, and uh, without a doubt, book a three pound fishing guide trip, because I tell you what, it'll be worth your time. You'll learn a lot about live scoping. You'll be flipping fish in the back of the live well right here. Everybody does. So you've all seen three pounds loop knot, and that's how I do mine. Make a loop. Run it through the eyelet. Run it through the loop. Keep your loop. Cinch it down. Wrap. Go back through the loop. Same direction you went through it. Tighten it down. Requires you to put your fingers in your mouth a lot. That's right. But it works. Oh, yeah, look at that view. I don't think they can see me. Marcus is out of view. Hello. <laughs> hello. 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 Uh, uh, right there. All right, good to go. I just did. No. <laughs> I flipped into the boat and it came up the hook and it never stopped moving. It went straight back out into the water. Yeah, that's a big fish. Boom. Good fish. Good mark here. That's a big fish. 13 and a half. We watched that guy come straight up. And a real slow, just you knew it was coming for it. Lightest bite. Barely felt it. Without live scope, I don't know. I wouldn't set that up. That is Cute. a awesome fish right there. Gosh dang. A good looking live well three pound. I'm telling you. Oh, big fish. I saw that sucker coming up. Thirteen and a half. I'll verify that. Yeah, 13. Call 13. Good fish. That's gonna end it today, folks, on a 13 and a half. Hammer, hammer. Good fishing, even on a tough day, great fishing. I tell you, it doesn't get much better than that. That's a beautiful thing right there. Thanks for watching another three pound fishing episode sponsored by these great companies.